The art project today is inspired by Among Us. Here is a group of Among Us characters with one imposter. Here are the materials that we need. For this project, we need a full sheet of paper and a quarter sheet. This quarter sheet is best if you use cardstock or a piece of paper that has some stiffness to it. This is going to be the Among Us character tracer, so it needs to be somewhat firm. Now let's get started on drawing the character. First we draw the face cover, and that is going to be a shape of an egg almost. Here I have kind of like a C line, and then I will go towards the right, that will be more, a little bit more pointy. And here is that egg shape. Starting from the top right of this egg shape, we're going to create that head line going towards the left, slightly up and over. And going to the back side is a little flat and also towards the front. It's not a straight line, it's somewhat very slightly curved. The front and the back. I'm doing a very rough drawing of this so my lines are super light and it would be quite easy to erase if I need to adjust anything. There are no corners, they're very very subtle corners, they're soft corners. At the bottom you have two legs, here are your somewhat flat feet, they're curved, not so straight edged, and then a line right in the middle of the legs here, that's more horizontal, but again slightly curved. So here you have two legs. Starting from here, kind of middle of that face cover, we're going to start our backpack right there. And then it is a parallel line, but as it gets closer towards the bottom, it gets closer to the body. So it curves slightly. Now give it a nice thick outline with a black marker, and then you want to cut that out. Now taking our full sheet of paper, we're going to take the tracer and trace a whole bunch of these crew members onto the full sheet. These shouldn't be traced edge to edge next to each other. It should be kind of slightly overlapping, but be careful not to draw it onto your last previous traced one. So here I'm going to the top layer, and I'm going from the right to the left, and then here, left to the right. And some of them will be really off to the edge, but that will be okay. Now that you have the outline of each crew member, go in the shape and draw the other details. Here I'm drawing all my egg shape face cover for each of them. Sometimes I put my stencil back on to kind of give me a visual of where the lines should be. Now with your whole crew drawn in, you want to choose one imposter. This one is going to be my imposter. It doesn't have to be the one in the middle, it can be anyone on your page. Add something to your imposter. I'm adding a little hat onto the head of this one, and he will be the one who is going to be standing out, but trying to stand in. Once you're all done with the pencil lines, give it a nice outline with the black marker. Once you're done with the outline, clean up all the pencil lines with the eraser. For the coloring, use any medium that you have. Here I'm using crayons. If you have markers or even paint, paint will be a really good choice for this project. First, color in all the face covering, leaving that oval reflection area. Find a slightly darker blue color to give the face covering a little bit of that shadow. I'm going to go in on the left side and towards the bottom edge of the face cover. And you want to do that on all of the face covers. Now for the final coloring pieces, you want to color in all of the crew members. I've decided to create a holiday theme, so I'm doing red and green and white, but you can do any color that you want for any of these. You can mix and match, make it super colorful, or you want to do all the same. Maybe the imposter is the one that is different. You decide and make it unique and different. For the finishing touches, I'm using my black crayon to create some shadows on the left and the bottom side of each crew member and a little bit on the backpacks. 
For the white crew members, I used a very light gray to create the shadows. With all the shadows in, you are done. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this project. I will see you next time. Bye.